The Sims, oh my god. We are finally playing with the new Sims 4 Dream Home Decorator Pack. I guess I'm doing a Let's Play. I didn't really intend to, but kind of turned into it. So here's part one. I'm starting off with my Sim here. Her name is Florence Machine. <laughs> and I'm gonna follow her in this new game pack career. I've already got her a job. We have the interior design career, obviously. And I've already got her a gig and everything. We start tomorrow at 9 a.m. But before we do that, I wanna build a starter home using only the new Sims 4 game pack with like a little bit of base game. So I'm not gonna use any other packs. I just wanna try and renovate this house in Willow Creek. I've moved her into like this one, a pretty, pretty generic, not much going on. I wanna renovate this little house. I wanna make a cute little starter for our like let's play. If you guys like the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I do actively answer my comments in the comments section. And if you wanna interact with me in real time, you can follow me on Twitch and Discord. And yeah, let's do this. <laughs> so inside this house, there is literally not much going on. It's very generic EA build. Uh, it's dark. It's empty. I'm probably gonna just go ahead and delete all of the objects that are in here. We're not keeping anything. I'm not gonna cheat my money or anything. I'm gonna keep just the budget for a starter. And I guess technically this is gonna be like my review as well. Like I haven't really put out a video about my thoughts or anything on this pack. So let's talk about it. The first thing I'm gonna do is like shrink this thing. Being a starter, I don't think I need that full like hallway. I was gonna try and do a video where I was using only the new items from the game pack, but I learned upon filming that video that there's no fridge. So like technically, I don't even know how I'm gonna get my sim to survive if I did that. I don't think I'm gonna do a whole lot of attention on the outside. I'm gonna probably do a lot of it off camera just because I really wanna focus on the items that come with the pack. And we don't get much exterior, which really bugs me. We get a cute new door, which I am gonna use. Like if I have the opportunity to use it, I will use it. Cute new door, but no new windows, which is such a shame because the door I think is adorable. Adorable, you see what I did there? Anyway, I'm also gonna be building according to my Sims likes, which I probably should have told you earlier. She likes electronic music. She likes video games. She doesn't like baking. Her favorite color is black. And I'm assuming green is gonna be in there. She looks like a little like Slytherin Sim. Excuse me, barking dogs. No, apparently nine Mia's house Slytherin. And then her favorite decor style is mid-century decor. So keeping that in mind, I'm gonna put my filters on base game only and dream home decorator. I'm also gonna try and save some money out here. Like the fence that we've got going on is one of the more expensive ones. I feel like we don't really need that. I just realized my freaking laundry is on. How unprofessional, you guys can hear my chores. These windows are gonna go. I wanted to use like the more modern like glass ones, but these are pretty pricey. Like the one that I wanted to use is $130 a piece. I can't afford that yet. Eventually we'll get there, but not today. We're gonna use a $35 lovely little window and call it a freaking day. So right now I'm kind of playing around with my layout a little bit. I'm gonna keep the bedroom at the front. My bathroom I think is gonna stay there and I can do like a little office area over there. And then living room can be right in the center and kitchen can stay where it was. And one thing that I am gonna review about the new Sims 4 Dream Home Decorator Pack is that I wish we had flooring. A nice like hardwood or a nice new tile or something would have been nice, but I am gonna be using the new wallpaper, that's for sure. This kind of like geometric style, I I love this. I think it looks really cool. My power color is black. Okay, I kind of want to go very dark with the wallpaper in here and then lighter with the decor. So let's start in the kitchen. I've got $6,000, I gotta watch it. I gotta watch the budget. I love that we get not one, but two counter sets in this game pack. I think I like this one better with the drawers than this one, I kind of like how how there's a little bit of like contrast with the doors in there. I like that. I wish we got a fridge. I'm gonna use this cheap one just cause I'm trying to save some cash here. But I really, really, really wish that we got a fridge. Like a nice retro style of fridge that matched the new like oven in this kind of style. I think it would have been so cool. Another thing I'm really, really loving is the cabinets. I love how they come with the clutter pieces in there. This budget is gonna kill me, I know it. <laughs> Wait, oh, okay, I'm gonna get rid of that. I don't actually need to put that on top. I thought to be functional, I had to put this and that, but I don't. Okay, so that could actually save me some space. I don't really wanna put this right next to the fridge. I'm gonna change that eventually, but again, saving money here. It's only a starter. I need to make sure that I keep that style in mind. She liked the mid-century style, so I need to make sure that I keep that. I wonder if they like did a revamp with these styles because I know in the past they were like not really the best to use. They left out a lot of items and that frustrated me. We're gonna see how it works in the actual career. I'm gonna fully do a full career with this sim. Hopefully I get a lot of 
of renovating it done with the with the sim in this. Let's play. Let's turn around and do the living room. So living room, the really exciting thing about this is we get these new sectionals. I love these so much. I'm gonna have a ball with these. I already know it. I can't freaking wait. So I'm gonna have green couch. My rug is way too small, but I still want to use it. If I size it up, it's too big. There needs to be like an in-between. I mean, I guess that can kind of work. I'm gonna use the new desk over here. This is gonna be my office area and uh, my, my girl loves video games. I gotta make sure she's got a nice little setup. Oh, this is a cheap desk. Okay, good. I also really love this chair. I'm gonna use this as like an office chair a lot. That's probably my new like favorite one. Very cute. And for computer, oh, I'm, I'm running low on cash. I gotta be careful. Computer might come next. Let's make sure that we've got the essentials before I get too crazy. So I'm gonna need to do a bathroom. We're going cheap with this stuff. Very, very cheap. They do come with a new bathtub, but it's pricey. This is a $900 bathtub. Uh, this one's over a thousand. So I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna try and get just a cheap bathtub for now, but we can use the new dream home decorator sink and mirror. We'll just splurge a little bit on her. <laughs> Even the mirrors. No, why are the mirrors so expensive? Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just a starter. Okay. I have $833. I need to be careful. We need to go into the bedroom. I at least need a bed and I don't think we're going to be able to afford a double, even though I love these beds. I really like the new addition of all of these new beds that we got with this pack here. I'm going to go with the green one and a dresser. I do need a dresser. We got to, we got to start our job off in style. If we get this shelf and then combine it with like the hanging clothes, which I love. I think this is so cute. And I think we can probably match the color that she's wearing. Adorable. Love that. Okay. So that's cheapest the cheapest option. I really want to include the shoes, but I know that I should probably be careful there. I think it's safe for me to say that my favorite, no, my favorite thing that comes with the new pack is the art because it's beautiful. Even like the new like wall decor is really, really pretty. Like this, love this. Maybe we'll just have to settle with some plants. And I do gotta say, I am kind of bummed that we didn't get more plants. We got this one, this like little feather thing, which is cute. Very trendy, very on 2021 trends. And this, I've been trying to get a new wall plant for so long. I always use that one from Dine Out. But now we've got this one, which I'm gonna be using in probably every single build from now on. Cool, okay, so I have $153. My house is looking a little empty, but I do have a gig tomorrow in the morning. I'm gonna do it. I think I'm gonna keep the $153 to my name. So this is my starter. Not bad for a starter, still very empty considering like I do need to fill this thing up a little bit, but we've got the essentials, we've got the basics, and we are ready to live our dream home decorator life. All right, Flo, let's freaking do this. I don't know how much I'm gonna include in this let's play about her actual like life. I think it's gonna be very career focused unless you guys want to see more of like Flo's journey and her personality and stuff like that. But I think it's gonna be a lot of focus on the actual building because that's what I like to do best. But yeah, let me know if you guys want to see me focus more on like the gigs or her actual um entire life. <laughs> Since this is only her first day, I don't think anything too exciting is gonna go on. She's entering her house and seeing her first look at her new starter home. I'm probably gonna to fast forward until uh until the gig which is 9 a.m tomorrow i just gotta keep her alive until then <laughs> i'm just gonna kind of go on uh, a little tangent here i'm a little upset that i didn't get a welcome wagon normally i'm like very quick to send them away but i'm still waiting and they haven't shown up and i'm a little hurt by it i won't lie how come i'm not getting a welcome wagon i just want the opportunity to send them away i mean okay basically what i've been doing is so far i've just been like living her life i've been trying to up the cooking channel because i don't want her to freaking die cooking so I know she's not a baker. She doesn't like to cook, but at least maybe we can learn a little cooking skill because I'm pretty infamous for killing my Sims very quickly by accident. <laughs> yeah, like what the heck? Okay, maybe I'll just like go out for a little bit. Just go like meet some Sims or something because no one is coming to see me. Okay, cute. We can hang out with uh, Julia Wright. We're playing a little bit of chess. I'm, I'm literally just passing time until I can go and do this freaking decor thing. Oh, she likes the color yellow. Yeah, no kidding. She's literally wearing it. There's a dream home decorator network. Can give your Sims ideas. Oh my God, why was I not doing that? I'm back home, by the way. I got bored of Willow Creek's freaking park. Cool, okay, um, nice. So that, watching that makes the handiness skill go up, which is kind of flying right now. Oh, she passed out. Okay, maybe she wasn't really enjoying that so much. Let's have some cereal and go to sleep in the morning. Morning, we can finally go to our gig. I'm still so offended that I didn't get a freaking welcome wagon. Oh my god. Okay, her gig starts in an hour. Get to the client's lot on time. Okay, I'm ready. Oh yeah, she's a vegetarian. I forgot about that. What are her traits? She's a vegetarian, she's materialistic, and she's a bruh. <laughs> gig starts in half an hour. Let's just chill, watch some TV, 
and then we're going to the munch house. Yes, let's go to work. It's ready, it's go time. I'm gonna be a dream home decorator. Yay, okay, all right, all right, all right. I do find this very exciting. I like the gameplay. I kind of think it's kind of fun. I'm intimidated. I feel like <laughs> I'm not really sure how Robert Munch is gonna, oh my God, it's not Robert Munch. That is a freaking author, Gunther Munch. I don't know much about this family. Don't know how he's gonna go and like my uh, ideas, but let's get to know him. Friendly introduction, let's start off on the right foot. Ask to see mood board discuss designs ask about favorite designs oh wait i want to see on the ipod hold on oh no 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 i'm not prepared for leopard print tell me it's not oh oh my god okay i'm afraid raw uh gunther munch so we like queen and decor i'm scared queen and decor is one that i'm not very good at it's kind of like a victorian style a little bit very like sims 4 base game s give me a color we like wellness Okay, and give me anything else. I gotta go in here. I've tried to renovate this house before. Look at how much of a disaster this home is. For a long time, that door didn't work. We got cement what the hallways. Very, very homey. I don't know why, like why, why? You couldn't just put a carpet or, you know, continue the hard way. Where is the rest of the fam here? Oh yeah, you, I forgot. Okay, Wolfgang, friendly introduction. Give me a color that I can work with. They got the same kind of like style. Wolfgang is a teen, so like, I don't think the, the friendship is gonna work out but hopefully maybe Wolfgang has like similar likes to us give me something good oh rock climbing I need a color I'm not putting a rock climbing wall in here so we better get over that oh my god okay um so all I really have to do is renovate a room I kind of want to do like a wellness room I mean I feel like that's what they're hinting at but how am I gonna do a queen and wellness room a riddle me that like should I just transform one of your bedrooms or something <gasps> this oh my god this room oh my god I forgot they have this little area okay I'm gonna renovate their like garage and I'm gonna make it into a wellness room I got this okay let's go take the before photos this room is cool I do like this room but you know they didn't really give us anything to work with that belongs in this room anyway let's take some photos <gasps> Florence does not seem like she's having a good time should he should she gain the dislikes of photography preference how are you gonna do this career? Photography is terrible. I mean, okay, if you don't like it, it's because she has to use the bathroom. I guess so. Oh, this is not gonna go well. <laughs> Yikes. Oh my God, what if she like refuses it? Oh, she's tense now. Oh, okay, I think I have enough pictures. I think I'm done. I don't wanna stress her out too much. Let's send the client away. You can leave now. Mila, I was gonna say Roberta. <laughs> yeah, yes, go. Thank you. They're not leaving. They're all still here. Okay, <laughs> well, I'm just gonna start building. You can just, you know, stand there and watch. <sighs> That's very irritating. Okay, I'm gonna delete everything in here. Everything must go. I wanna see, first of all, what we have to work with for the queen and decor. It's definitely gonna make for a weird wellness room. I don't think I'm gonna use the pack restrictions anymore. I kinda wanted to just see what I could do with the starter home. So all of this is gonna be fair game now. I think first I'm gonna get my like wellness stuff and some lighting. One thing that bugs me, I think, I don't know if it's a bug, it's probably, it's, got, it's a bug, Um, I think, is the shift button doesn't work when you're in build mode. I don't know if that's just me dealing with that, but you can use alt to just do the one, but you can't use shift to do like the entire room. That bothers me because I use shift a lot. Wellness, I think that means we're gonna have to do like a yoga area and the rock climbing. I can't, how am I gonna do rock climbing? It won't fit in your house, so you're just not getting that, I'm sorry. I guess we can maybe try and make it like gothic a little bit like Queen Anne but like gothic style that's a Queen Anne item I'm doing this little like meditation area how is this Queen Anne I feel like that's so like boho but okay I'll freaking roll with it all right so this is gonna be my meditation area I guess I like it I think that's cute we'll add another mirror there we go very um non-traditional kind of like meditation area but hey this is what this is what the client wants this is what the client is gonna get same as like the mirrors over here like I'm not gonna really do the full-length mirrors I don't think this is gonna be what I'm gonna do for like the yoga area I kind of like the idea of just having really random towny likes like this is so weird I would never would have done like a Queen Anne style wellness room but it kind of pushes you out of your comfort zone so I personally as a builder think that that kind of gameplay is fun that literally is the way that I played the sims in the first place but like I said before when I was kind of like talking about the trailer and stuff if you don't like building I really don't know how you could like this game pack and technically it is a game pack so I don't know I don't know non builders what do you think what if I did a grass wall for some reason that is included in this wall decor so I mean I'm gonna try and go with it I won't lie if someone came in and did this to my house I'd be 
got a mat. Like before they had this like dartboard, it was really great and I'm turning it into a freaking fitness thing. I mean, to each their own, but I personally would not be very happy about it. This is totally gonna ruin the surprise too. Like they're standing right there. I wanted to do like the reveal and everything. You couldn't have left for like two seconds, huh? Okay, I think this is gonna be it. I got $717. I don't think I'm gonna spend it because we already got a lot going on in here. <laughs> There's a whole lot and I hope they like it. I'm a little nervous about it, but I think it's gonna be okay. Let's go live. I didn't do a rock climbing thing, so they might be mad at that. I don't know. Let's see. Let's go take some after photos. This is so weird. You guys are not supposed to be here. And you're gonna be in my shot. Okay, no, they're, they're not. Thank goodness. Honestly, I feel like this renovation does kind of fit our sim though a little bit, so I kind of don't feel that bad. Okay, who are we flirting with? No, you can't do that. The Sims, oh my God. Maybe we only sent away Gunther, like, okay, let's pick some after. <laughs> there we go, we're calling our client back to the lot. Oh, are you really gonna go outside and then come back? Yes, I wanna show it off, I wanna show it off. Reveal renovated space, come and see. Oh my God, look it, they're all covering their eyes as if they weren't all just in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay. I think it's so funny how they cover their eyes, especially you, you saw it. Oh my god, Mila, you are such a faker. <laughs> also, this slideshow just cracks me up. Wow, look at my amazing photography skills. Okay, yeah, let's go show off the objects. This is one of the weirdest rooms that like. Okay, do you like it? I'm nervous, I kinda get like a little anxious. Okay, yeah, you do like it, thank goodness. How about this one, you like this? Check this out. Okay, they seem happy, happy client. I got it. I want a promotion. If I can get a promotion, I'll be happy. I really want to make more renovations to my house. They seem happy. Even the kid is happy. Thank for the opportunity. Let's just build a little rapport, you know. Now we just kind of have to wait for them to like check it out, which I think takes a little while. So I'm going to stop talking to them, allow them to like walk around, like keep the conversations to a minimum, you know? Oh, this is a lot to take in. I'm ready to talk, to talk about the changes. Okay, she looks happy. Ask for final verdict. She looks very happy. She's like, what do you think? Oh, she loves it. She loves it. I kind of want to do like a bad renovation and like see if it can actually be like awful if they actually really hate it. Okay, how about you? Are you done? No. <laughs> I have to ask all four of them. Oh my God, even the child. You better stop talking. Oh my God, wait, what if my like career runs out? I'm ready to wrap this up. Okay, they're all ready. Phew. I've heard there are issues with the career. I know a lot of simmers have had an issue with the Sims 4 Dream Decorator like careers. In this Let's Play so far, I haven't dealt with any issues. I'm also doing a Let's Play on stream, like a Rags to Riches style. Didn't really deal with any bugs over there either. Um, So for me, I think the pack works great so far. We'll see. I think it's like as you progress in this gameplay. I bet you Wolfgang would hate it. Four out of four. That's how you freaking do it. We got $712, our reputation improved. I'm out of here. We're gonna go home into our new starter. In the next episode, I'm definitely gonna do a little bit more renovations. We can use more packs. I just wanted to kind of see how it would work with the new one. Did I get promoted or anything? Yes, I did. We got promoted. Hell yeah. An extra $370 on top of the $712 that we got. Cool. Good job, my Slytherin queen. Florence machine. <laughs> I hate rhymes so much. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna end this Let's Play here. Let me know. Um, I'm kind of curious. Do you guys want to see more about her like life and her relationships and things like that? Or do you want me to focus mostly just on the career and her climb of that? Let me know in the comment section down below. This is episode one of my Sims 4 Dream Decorator, Dream Home Decorator Let's Play. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!